Check out this Honda race car at Shockley Honda. If you enjoy local content like this, please like, comment, and share this video. Help us out a lot if you like, comment, and share. Hi, my name is Holden. I'm here at Shockley Honda. I'm very excited to be working with them for the 2019 uh, race season this year. They're going to be helping uh, sponsor the vehicle. I got into high performance driving about five years ago. That led into me racing starting a year ago was my rookie season. I race with NASA and race in Honda Challenge H2. Um, we travel in our region throughout the year, eight races, VIR, pit race, Summit Point. Um, and then there's a championship at the end of the season, at the end of each year. My race car started out as a stock 2000 Civic Si. Over the last five years, have slowly transformed it into a formidable Honda Challenge race car. I run an Integra Type R engine. The chassis, me in it, and fuel is 2,500 pounds for spec, 190 horsepower. The majority of the tracks that we run in our mid-Atlantic region is uh, Virginia International Raceway in Alt, Virginia, uh, Summit Point in Summit Point, West Virginia, uh, Pitt Race, Pittsburgh uh, International Race Complex. The championship this year will be at Mid-Ohio, and we'll try to maybe get out of region for another race or two, possibly Road Atlanta or Watkins Glen. Uh, as far as the brakes and suspension are concerned, I'm running a double adjustable front coilover, uh, also running the Fast Brakes StopTech STL brake kit up front, 10 millimeter spacers, and we all for our series have to run Toyo RR tires. So we're limited to tire width. Um, I run a 15 inch wheel with a 205 or 225 tire. Try to find the lightest wheel possible within reason for, for, the, uh, for the vehicle, so. So for the, the Honda Challenge series, we're allowed to, to modify the chassis and the engine. The rules are based on a horsepower to weight ratio and your weight is based off of what, what horsepower and what engine you're running. I chose to run a uh, B-series engine out of an Integra Type R. The internal engine modifications are very limited. You're allowed adjustable cam gears. Other than that, it's just bolt-ons running a, uh, an aftermarket intake, an aftermarket header. Uh, I'm running uh, RDX injectors, uh, a larger radiator, OS Kaiken differential. I've changed the, the final drive as well. Other than that though, it remains relatively stock overall for, for what it is. And I've also switched to, uh, to a Honda at a coil on plug setup as well to eliminate the, the failures of the distributor. Uh, you can follow me on Facebook at Holden Metzner. You can follow me on Instagram at hmetzner84. If you enjoy local content like this, please like, comment, and share this video. If you own a local business, please join us.